But this is what happened to Andrew Tate, right? He got canceled as being as people making assumptions about his character when they don't fucking know his character, right? Because like like you somebody can say any like does that do, do I agree with everything that he said about like like women and shit? No. Am I personally offended by anything he said? No. Because I don't know him, right? But like I also see that he's a smart man. He's extremely intelligent. He has a, he, he, his, his, he's a ma he has a six, like massively successful business, online business. I, he, uh, how, and, uh, and then you start seeing, seeing like, oh, well, how did he do that? Well, uh, uh, one of the reasons how he did that is by being polarizing. You have to be you, being polarizing is an asset when, in order to stand out on the internet and social media. If 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 fifty percent of people love you and fifty percent of people hate you, that's a pretty good ratio. That's a pretty good ratio because you, then because that polarization is getting attention. That attention is getting some people are going to hate you. Cool, fuck off. The people that are going to love you are going to fucking love you, and they're your tribe, right? And that's who you want. So you're 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 broadcasting yourself to more people to to fucking love you, right? And so it's it's like. So, like, why, why does that mean if he has a controversial opinion from some from some outtakes that are people are posting on like of his content about this or that? Why does that why why does that give the powers that be the right to to cancel him, to remove him completely, to delete him? What gives them the right to do that? So that we don't have free speech. That's what it's saying. It's saying we don't have free speech. It's saying if you get if if you become so successful, if you be if you reach this level of success and you're still voicing your fucking opinions freely, then you're gone. Mm -hmm. You're gone. Because if he wasn't successful, no one would even give a shit. There's people every like regular people every day that post crazy wild shit on Instagram, and no one gives a shit because they're nobodies. Yeah. But if you reach this level of success and you're making this much money, and and you're making this money from an online business, meaning on over the internet, well, if it's successful, now you're not allowed to voice an opinion. Now, if you're voicing an opinion and you're and you're making your money from the internet, boop, you're off the internet. You know that's fucking wrong. That's wrong. Yeah. That's way more wrong than any like controversial opinion Andrew Tate said about anything. About like you know women like obviously like you know like calling them bitches or whatever okay like okay I can see how people are like that's not cool but I can also see people like that's just how he fucking talks okay mm -hmm. that's how he talks that's how he talks people can talk however the fuck they want and I'm not gonna and I'm gonna be able to sit there and go okay well this is how this person is is expressing themselves this is how they talk if if it's not the way I would talk who am I to go you have to talk the way I talk you know what I'm saying. Or you don't have the right to speak if you're not going to use the terminology that that I that that I agree with, mm -hmm. right? That, that this is there. Where's this is like a this is a creating a, a fucking a world where there only one voice is allowed to speak, instead of all voices are allowed to speak and have a fucking conversation. Well, I, I hear you loud and clear on the Tate thing. We sat down with Tate for I know I watched five whole, six I hours. Whole thing. I mean, we, like I think it's absolutely disgusting that they I watched the, the whole the, thing. a lot of these digital uh, social governments have have canceled him. They do have terms of services. That's a whole conversation. Where I think I got really disgusting are the credit card processors and Ubers yeah. and PayPal yeah. uh -huh. and Airbnb and exactly. Discord. What the fuck like, is what that? Is that all <laughs> what about? is that? That's insane to me. So if you like this clip and you want to watch another one, click right here. And if you want to watch the entire podcast, click right here.